Hi guys, and thank you for joining us for our uh, quick training session today. We're just going to go through on how to add uh, redirection to external numbers on call queues and auto attendance, which is a, a great new feature in Microsoft Teams. Just to quickly go over what we're going to do is feature overview, uh, looking at licensing your resource account, uh, the how to assign a phone number to your resource account, you'll need this, and how to assign a dial plan so you've got access to do it. So let's jump right into it and jump across to our admin portal. So if we go into a call queue now, and I go into my training webinar call queue, let's wait for Microsoft to load. As you scroll down, you can see you've now got this redirection to external phone number as, as an option. So you can also go to voicemail, voice app, person, so external organization. When you key in a number, you do need to put it in E164 format. Now for this to work, you will need your resource account to have a phone number. So as you can see, my account doesn't have a phone number assigned to it. So what we need to do is go and assign a phone number to it. So what we will need is the phone system virtual user license uh, from the Office 365 portal. So what we're going to do is quickly jump over to our admin portal. And when this loads, we're then going to go to our users, go to our active users. We're going to go and find our webinar user, uh, webinar training. We're going to click on the user. As you can see, I've already got the, the license assigned to it. So I've already got the phone system virtual user license assigned to it. So that's great. Uh, while I wait for that to load, we're going to jump back into Teams admin portal. Um, as you go through then, you then need to assign a phone number to that call queue, otherwise you won't be able to do external calls. Um, once we've signed a phone number, you then also need to add it to the outbound dial plan. It's where a number of people have made some mistakes, they haven't actually given it the ability to dial out. So let's jump over the PowerShell and see how this works. So we've created a little script here. So we're just gonna go connect to our, our 365. going to pop up my two-factor authentication. Hoping everyone is running multi-factor now with all the latest security enhancements out there. Make sure everything stays secure. Going to prove that login. Yeah, all approved logs me in. So there's two commands we, we need to do and we will stick these in the notes uh, of, of this webinar. So we need to go and assign the phone number. So we go in and we assign the phone number. Once that phone number is assigned, we then need to go and give it access to the outbound dial pad. So we go and run the grant access command and that will go through once that's done, you should then be able to jump back into your org-wide setting under your resource account. And you will see my webinar training user now has a phone number. It's now got access, so now when I ring that call queue, when it hits the overflow rules, it will now divert out to the external number. Uh, thanks guys for joining today. We're trying to do more of these uh, simple videos to help you uh, get this new feature set ready. Keep an eye out for the next one. If you've got any questions, as always, you can contact our support team. Uh, they'll be more than happy to help you out. Thanks, guys, and look forward to seeing you next time. Bye.